Hello and welcome to the reading of the catch of the day for July 6, 2022. <clears throat> Excuse me. Our uh, title today for our catch is Hemingway Slept Here. Richard Mao President Emeritus of Fuller Theological Seminary in Pasadena, California, and our guest last week on Blog Talk Radio, told a story about a janitor he got to know when he had a job as a night watchman. He related how he really didn't like the janitor very much. He wasn't very intelligent. He talked a lot when Richard wanted to do other things, and just basically irritated him. One night, when he was chatting with the janitor, the janitor brought up somebody named Ernie. He went on and on about Ernie, as if Richard knew who he was talking about. Finally, Rich asked him, who was this Ernie guy he was always referring to? Oh, said the janitor, I guess I didn't tell you. Uh, that was Ernest Hemingway. Turns out that for three summers, this janitor was Hemingway's fishing guide on special trips. They were together all the time, even slept in the same tent. This definitely made a difference in how Rich viewed this person. Now, does that mean the man suddenly possessed a worth he didn't have before Rich knew this about him? No, it only means Rich suddenly saw him as what he was, someone with great value as a person made in God's image and as someone with a fascinating story. You know what? That works for everyone. Everyone has incredible worth, no matter who they voted for, no matter what social class they are in, whether they are smart or dumb, or what religion they follow or none, or whether they were top of the class or bottom of the special needs group, everyone has worth because they were made in the image of God and everyone has a fascinating story to tell. And if you care enough, you make it to hear it. This is John Fisher for the catch of the day. Grace turned outward.